Xavier is the only team the Providence Friars have not beaten this season in the Big East. Pipkin for three. Got it. Red hot. This time, here we need to go. Here's A.J. Reed with the drive. Off the glass and in. Here's Carter on the baseline. Looked into Jones, is knocked away and stolen. Here's Diallo now. The pull up for three. Two, got it. He'll go inside to Watson. Kick out Diallo for three. Yes. Kiki Tandy is checked in as well. Diallo with the runner. No, the follow though by Watson. Even. Pipkins a pull up. Got it. To inbound. Knocked away by Pipkin. And he lays it up and in. There's Diallo. Good call, fake and dry. Pipkins knocks it down. Here's Pipkins with five. Knocks it down. Diallo. Reed from deep. Splat. Back to their zone. Three on the shot clock. The three is good. Bagging these wins. Pipkins finally misses. Diallo, though. The board. Duke knocks it down for three. Fremantle, though. The board. He has it knocked away. Pipkins from distance. Yes! Kiki's got eight. Duke to the cup. Diallo, no, but the follow by A.J. Reed. Ten on the shot clock for Pipkins. Diallo, he'll pull up off the glass. Diallo, step back from the baseline. Inside to Young, and he just bodies his way. He's tonight. First time, what, 27 years? Yep. Could be a big night at the Rock. Oh, good try. Gant challenges Fremantle and knocks it down. Here's Diallo. Working on Marshall. Backs him down. Banks it home. Misses that three. Diallo the board. And they get another crack. They'll go to their senior. And he lays it in. Now Watson. Duke will pull up. Got it. Diallo from the baseline. Lays it in. And the points for the freshman. Oh, Diallo. He just can't be stopped. Pipkins for three. Oh, what a shot by the Wild Pipkins. Here's a great example of sharing the basketball. Diallo has been a star in the second half, passing it off to his new teammate. 30 to play. Pipkins penetrates. Runner. And rolls in. You're looking at the biggest coach of the year, Ed Cooley. for Ed Cooley and Providence, their fifth straight. No team hotter in the conference than Ed Cooley's Providence Friars.